Hello, I want to focus this video on uh, Dave Cockrum, one of my favorite artists. And I have here in front of me a beautiful copy of X-Men 100, as you can see. It's a gorgeous copy. And um, when I was doing my series of X-Men from uh, giant size X-Men 1, X-Men 94 through 143 I purposely left out this issue um, to talk about extensively because in my opinion um, this is Dave Cockrum's finest work maybe not on the cover, it's a, it's a good cover okay um, it's well done, but as far as the interior work, you know, it is absolutely phenomenal. And um, Dave Cockrum did ink as well as pencil everything himself on some of the issues in the early X-Men run. And this is one of them. And uh, if you have not had a chance to uh, read this book, hopefully someday you will. As you can see, uh, it does not have any credit of an inker here, but it's a really good splash page, certainly not his best, but other than that, um, I love this book on the inside. Uh, his is page two and three. It's a giant, massive battle scene between the X-Men. It is absolutely fantastic. Like I said, it's my favorite Dave Cockrum penciling by far in any of the X-Men book that he did. Um, let's see. Dave Cockrum, I said, uh, it is, I think, underappreciated in my opinion in many ways because, uh, you know, when you uh, have to uh, be compared with uh, John Byrne. You know, it's uh, certainly a tall order to uh, stand up to, but uh, his inking is absolutely great. You can see right here. Um, and, you know, it's. I can say that, you know, he definitely fall into uh, the category that, you know, one of those. Uh, great artist that is his own best inker if he has the time you know sadly a lot of these guys are just not uh, fast enough to do everything as far as penciling and inking uh, each month it's a lot of work it takes a lot of great details to put together the work but it is so well done Let's see, I'm going to go through some more pages here. It is a great page with Wolverine, as you can see right here. Where he uh, you know, went psycho on Marvel Girl because he know it's not her. It's a robot. Look at this beautiful, another beautiful double page spread. Like I said, Dave Cockrum at his finest, you know, yeah. really, really great stuff. I mean, he outdone himself with this issue. I think uh, whenever I flip through this particular issue, I can't help but uh, feel that it is his best work. From the first day that I opened this book and read it, and even today, you know, I... Uh, I have a hard time not thinking that it is his finest work uh, ever in any comic books. But anyhow, thanks for watching, and um, you know, if you have a chance to pick it up or read this book, do so because I think you will be very pleased with the artwork. And here is the last page. As you see, Jean make the sacrifice to try to save the X Men which lead to the next issue 101 the birth of phoenix 
classic page classic page I think if there was ever going to be you know the most expensive Phoenix original arts is going to be this page because this is the start of it all right here where you know Gene make the sacrifice and of course the cover for 101 with the Phoenix rising out of the water but uh, beautiful work and uh, definitely my favorite Dave Cockrum interior work okay uh, anyhow thanks for watching and uh, until next time